Welcome back, everyone. Today, I'll walk you through the process of setting up an HTTP custom for your V2Ray slow DNS server. But before we dive in, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tutorials like this. Step one, V2Ray server. First things first, if you haven't already, make sure to check out my previous video on creating a V2Ray slow DNS server. It's crucial to have that foundation in place before proceeding. Step two, install HTTP, custom. Now, head over to your mobile app store, download and install HTTP custom. Once installed, launch the app and you'll find yourself on the home screen. Step three, configure V2Ray and slow DNS. On the home screen, locate and check the boxes for both V2Ray and slow DNS to configure their settings. This is a crucial step in ensuring a seamless setup. Step four, slow DNS settings. Click on the plugin icon at the top center of the app. Next, navigate to the slow DNS settings label to fine tune your configuration. Input the DNS server, name server, and public key, all of which you can find in the server creation video I posted earlier. Step five, V2Ray settings. With slow DNS configured, it's time to set up V2Ray. Again, click on the plugin icon to expand settings. Then click on the V2Ray settings label to access its configuration. Locate the clipboard icon, paste the V2Ray slow DNS server you created, and then go back to the home screen. Step six, connect VPN. Finally, return to the home screen and tap on the connect button to initiate the VPN connection. It's that simple. Your V2Ray slow DNS server is now ready to go. Conclusion. There you have it. A comprehensive guide to setting up an HTTP custom for your V2Ray slow DNS server. If you found this tutorial helpful, please like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.